What's going on, Blake? This is Daniel from Josh and Danny SEO. So we're going to take a look at your website, see what's going on, and see if we can help. So uh, right off the bat, uh, my painter on exteriors, mypainterco.com. Excellent. You have your number up here. There's nothing wrong with that. I would probably put it next to the contact um, area. You do have a scroll down for your service, so that's excellent. You definitely want that. So now anyone can basically just pick out what they want by just uh, scrolling through that and then quickly go read what they want and then call you. That's the whole point. So interior, exterior, painting professionals, excellent. Um, quick responses, select your appointment date, uh, painter's promise, which is great from start to finish, what the process will be, it's in the detail, and then what customers say. Okay, this is what I'm looking at. Interior painting, exterior painting, carpet trim, exterior. You typically want this all the way up top because you uh, order of uh, information they come to your website looking for help. They want to see what you're offering, um, you know, like make sure that you actually have the service and then scroll down and find it if they want to trust you or not. Uh, and then obviously you do want to talk about this stuff a little bit more. I like how you do have links to other pages, but you want to talk more about it because um, Google loves content and the more content you have, the better it is for Google. So um, they just want to see that you, uh, you know, 1,500, 2,000 words of content on the homepage alone. Uh, you do have that. I love the create a video walkthrough. That's excellent. And then finally, we're at the bottom of the page. Now, um, overall, like I said, solid website. I would work on the content area of it so you can definitely dominate in the area. Um, but let's take a look at the back and see what we got going. So my painter co. So you have a UR rating of 8, and a UR rating is basically how much Google likes your website. And then you have a DR rating of 0.9, which is how much Google trusts you. And... Ah, sorry, I forgot where I left off over here. Um, DR rating, like I said, is how much Google trusts you. All of this is about backlinks. So backlink is where you have your um, website link somewhere else so somebody can click on it, and a referring domain is when it actually does come back to you. Now, uh, the more you have that are strong referring domains are great. Um, not all are created equal. Some of them are more spammy than others, like BuzzFeed and Wikipedia. We definitely do not want those. But you do have 69 organic keywords on here as well. Let's find out what they are. So an, an organic keyword is what somebody might put into Google to find you. Now, okay, you lost a couple of them over here. That's great. But Painters Arlington, Virginia, 100 people a month search for it. Zero traffic right now because you have... Oh, wait, are you getting zero traffic? Yeah, oh, you're getting one person to upside a month? Anyway, I don't know where the 1A is, but it seems like you have, you're doing really good with the... Um, I don't know if this is a recent revamp, but you're doing good with getting those keywords in here. You're just not high enough in the rankings in order to actually take advantage of that traffic. But these are very good keywords to have because it's very location and very service specific. And that's what you want. You don't want anything that's like this, protect painters review. Um, not a very good keyword in here because anyone can use it. And it seems like you did get rid of it. So that's good. Um, but exterior painters, Fairfax, Virginia, 30 months, zero. You're on page number two and a half. So you're not really going to get anywhere with that. You got to get to the front page. Um, but let's take a look at a, you know some of your competition, right? So I put in painters, Arlington, Virginia. And you know we got our Google guaranteed over here. And then we have our ads, which are fine. Anyone can can pay for an ad. If you do it well, you can get some excellent quick conversions. If you do it poorly, unfortunately, it will hurt you. Um, and then we have your um, uh, Google My Business profile. It's very important to get in here. About thirty to forty percent of all businesses will be uh, thirty to forty percent of all people will click on one of these guys. So you definitely want to be in the top three. But then we got our organic search. Anyone can go over here. We got Yelp, Home Advisor, and then we got My Arlington Painter. And here's where I found, which was very interesting. It looks very identical to your current website. The only difference is the is the uh, you know this one's MyArlingtonPainter.co and this one .com and this one is MyPainterCo.com. So I don't know what's up either. I mean, you do have two identical websites um, kind of going for you. Yes, the the domain names are different, and therefore you're getting a result because this one over here is getting a much higher result than your other website and i'm wondering if you're just trying to uh you know increase you know have multiple websites out there uh rank multiple websites so you can get you know a better shot or somebody you know created a copy but the number is the same so i i'm a little confused i'll let you kind of answer that for me but UR rating for this one's 15, DR rating is 9, so it's a little bit better than the other one. I would find out what referring domains you have on this one and put it on your other website there. You do have 51 organic keywords. You are pulling in uh, 99 people a month through your website. So let's find out what those organic keywords are. So right off the bat, we got Arlington Painter, Painting Arlington. So you're doing really well as far as like uh, keyword uh, keyword specific stuff. You are getting the traffic because you're in the position to get it. And it seems like you got smart and you started getting rid of you know, area, just like international keywords. So I'm going to assume you got somebody working with you right now who really does know what they're doing 
You should probably get rid of this guy, though. Um, because you're not doing terribly. I mean, you're, you're only ranking for like eight keywords here. Two, four, six, seven keywords. The rest of them, uh, well, you lost those. That's fine. But you uh, you did add a new one. House Painters for FX Virginia, 50, zero. Uh, traffic, 30 a month. Well, you're position 30. So that means you're page three. So, yeah, um, doing fine on that one. Um, so, yeah, that's the only thing I find that's weird is that you're, uh, you have two, two of the same websites out here. Um, like I said, identical, just different domain names. So I don't know if one of them is a Legion site and one of them is more of a, um, I wouldn't say Legion, but one of them's a Legion and one of them's a, you know, your actual website or you have a website out here and you, you know, you created a second one for some reason, but both of them are still up and running. Um, but if you wanted to rank higher, content is key. Talk more about your website, uh, not, not more about your website, more about your services. Add a lot of more buyer intent keywords in here as well. You're already doing a good job of that. You got to get more backlinks in here so you can increase the ranking on this guy, but your other website's doing fine. So, um, yeah, I hope, uh, you know, if I am confused about what's going on and if you are uh, unsure about, you know, that second website too, you know, of course, please feel free to reach out. Let me know if you have any questions. I would love to know. Other than that, you have a going, Blake.